Senator and Operations Manager of the Goodwill Fishermen Cooperative Society Limited, Kjiana Tuse Shallery, says there has been a significant surge in interest in having the vessel monitoring devices placed since 2024 started, despite fishermen pausing to have them installed and functional on their vessels in the later half of 2023. The Senator spoke to reporters ahead of Monday's February 19th Upper House sitting of the Senate. We had had a bit of a, a, um, a lull in the installation of the vessel monitoring systems, but we have restarted. I know in the last two weeks or so, some of the other sites such as Canaries and the East Coast and so on have had installations there. Tuse Shalri notes at present the fisheries department is waiting to take the next step in having those devices functional for the fishermen who already have them installed on their vessel. We're waiting to move to the next step where the fishers, because although some of them have it um, installed, uh, we, they've not able to, been able to access it on the, virtually. And so we're waiting for us to move into that other aspect of the project with um, the technical team from Digicel, where the fishermen will be able to virtually, from at home or so on, actually be able to track the, um, their vessels, which is the real purpose of us in doing the installation. She further stated at present the cooperative is looking forward to the duty refund payout by government to fisher folk. We also look forward to the first um, duty refund payout where the additional dollar that um, the Prime Minister did announce would have been added to the already dollar and 50 cents. Um, so that should be effective in the quarter ending September 2023, which has not yet been paid out. Um, when I last spoke to the Department of Fisheries, I know it was being processed. And so we do look forward to seeing the rebate with now $2.50. Um, so that is a bit exciting for us. We're looking forward to it. Tuse Shalri notes, since the project was first launched, the hesitancy among fishermen has seemingly decreased. However, despite this, the senator once again urged fishermen to come on board with the initiative despite any skepticism they may face as these devices may be their saving grace on the waters should they ever be lost at sea. For Choice News Now, I am Chelsea Austinay.